you guys. Um, I wanted to do a video here about some chains that I recently put on this uh, tractor. This is my John Deere LA-105. And we recently purchased a new home. And there's some, there's some hills out here. There's a lot of hills out here. The house that we owned prior was 100% uh, level and I had about a half acre to mow with this machine so I, I guess I've had this about uh, seven years and when we got out here to the new house I knew it was going to be difficult I just I guess I underestimated um, how difficult mowing uh, two acres would be with with all these hills so my dad actually had a great idea um, which was get the chains and maybe that'll that'll help and it has really helped um, I hope that you were able to see from that little clip how steep that hill is um, it's it's difficult to walk down uh, or up so to ask this uh, tractor to go straight up it that's that's probably one of the steeper points in the yard um, and it has no problem climbing it it's uh, the first time I went up it it's a little hairy you wonder whether or not the front's going to come back on you and I've even wondered if I could add some weight to the front because that's that's not the only bad place in the yard and again I a video may not do it justice it's uh, you may only <laughs> it may just just be a thing to experience but uh, the chains worked really well I can tell you that that it wouldn't go up the hill without the chains uh, it would just get maybe halfway up and start spinning and you just gotta put the brakes on and and actually the brakes won't even hold you on that hill it's uh, you can't go down it uh, unless you just want a free will but uh, if you've thought and you've wondered whether or not chains would make a difference for you in your yard uh, I would say give them a try um, because it made a difference in being able to mow mine uh, for, I went from oh crap what am I gonna do how am I gonna mow this to uh, it's doable and if you've got a yard that uh, that needs that and you're having difficulty getting up in some spots try these chains now I'll throw a little caution out there they may put you in a spot uh, that you don't need to be in um, use them with caution I almost had a uh, an incident yesterday where I was on such a steep angle that the wheels I couldn't get them to turn uh, but the re the rear wheels with the chains were going to continue to drive me on up. So um, uh, it, it almost put me in a situation that I couldn't get out of. So again, you know, if you've got some common sense, you shouldn't have any problems. Just be aware that uh, it it can make things really easy for you, and it could put you in a really bad situation probably pretty quick. So anyway. Um, they're kind of a booger to get on, as with any tire chain. Uh, I don't know that you can make that any easier. They, I believe they came with some steel uh, tie wraps, we'll call them. Zip ties, stainless steel. And I just use those to hold uh, the excess chain uh, right here tight. And there uh, again I'm sure you can uh, my dad actually got me these he was he was really concerned about me mowing on these hills so I can't even tell you the price of them um, all I could do is thank my dad for getting them for me because it's been a uh, a heaven sent to have them but uh, uh, the installation uh, not very difficult it's a little cumbersome 
maybe maybe just as easy for you to take the wheel off uh, to make sure that you've got a nice tight fit. But uh, it's, it's made a difference for me. Just thought you might like to see them, and uh, if it helps you out, great. Thanks for watching.